I'm Morgan Poliquin, President and CEO of Almadex Minerals. Yeah, Almadex has uh, got 20 projects uh, and about 20 royalties, and is the those are the uh, legacy of 20 years of exploration in Almadem Minerals. Almadem Minerals is now focused on uh, discovery, uh, the Extaca deposit in eastern Mexico, and it's moving towards a production decision, we think, as early as 2018 in Almaden. And so uh, Almadex is now focused on early, the early stage exploration and drilling uh, that resulted in the Extaca discovery. Uh, and so it's uh, an exploration focused company while Almaden uh, is a single asset development company now focused on Extaca. Uh, El Cobre uh, was originally part of the Cabal Blanco project, and Cabal Blanco is uh, a gold resource. And the company that was focused on developing that in 2013 um, wanted to acquire 100%, and uh, through that process, we negotiated uh, getting uh, El Cobre back, so to speak, uh, 100% into then Almaden and now Almadex. And it's a copper gold porphyry system and it had never been the focus of a systematic exploration program. However, there was some exciting drill results from some of our uh, four past partners who have worked on the property, uh, holes that ended in pretty significant copper gold grades. So uh, subsequent to the spin out, uh, Almadex uh, refocused on El Cobre. And in August of this year, we followed up uh, some of those historic results and, and reported some, some really exciting uh, copper gold intervals. Uh, it's a large copper gold porphyry system. There's uh, about four, uh, four by four kilometers of alteration, and we think we're on the outer edges of uh, a large uh, center that we feel in the historic data we're able to identify. So, uh, the results that we reported so far this year are going into uh, a large, uh, the planning for a large systematic drill program for 2017. Uh, where we are at El Cobre is about 100 meters above sea level. Uh, the adjacent Cabal Blanco property is about 600 meters above sea level, and that difference is uh, a large area of uh, alteration, which we call a lithocap, and that's the top of a porphyry system. So where we are at El Cobre, that top is being removed. Uh, we're at the very top of where you expect to see copper gold porphyry mineralization, and some of the historic RC drilling that that we did uh, as Almaden historically, and and some of the drilling that partners have done of have definitely shown the potential. Uh, but again, we have uh, a lot of geophysical data and geochemical data that uh, suggests that the, the center of the system has never been drilled. So uh, the process now with these great drill results uh, that we've achieved this year is to, we, we see that we're on the fringes and not in the center. So we want to use the systematic uh, drilling approach to, uh, to explore that large geophysical and geochemical anomaly. Uh, you know, the issued capital, we've got about 44 million shares uh, uh, issued and we've got, uh, in terms of our treasury, we've got three and a half million in cash. Uh, we've got a working capital of about seven million in total, including the cash, uh, some gold bullion we have on our books, as well as some liquid equities. So we feel we're in a very good position when you think that we are drilling with our own internal drill. Uh, group uh, and we drill for very inexpensively and 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 to great depth so uh, all put together we feel we're in good shape um, to tackle the El Cobre project in 2017